Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new, then you can subscribe, obviously. But what this vlog is about is I'm going to be cleaning the floor of my closet. Because if you've seen it in a few videos in the past, you know how disgusting the bottom of my closet is. It's not really disgusting. It's just that there's a lot of junk on the bottom of my closet, like blankets, pillows. There's all kinds of stuff on the bottom of my closet and in my closet, on my closet floor that just needs to be gone and cleaned. So I will show you a bit far because you guys are going to come with me to cleaning this. This is what I mean. Guys can't see it. Hopefully this light works, because I have a light in here. Yes, it works. This is what I mean. Look at that disgusting mess. It's not disgusting. It's just that it needs clean. Like, it's so bad. Like, my closet has never been that bad before. Well, it has, but, like, I clean it within a month of it being like this. That, but it's been like this for more than a month now. So, what we're going to do is go see if we have big enough boxes in the basement or empty, just empty boxes that I can bring up so I can use them. And then put my junk in, this junk in it, the boxes, and then stack them on, in my closet, like stack them on top of each other so then it's not as cluttery. So, let's go in the basement and find some boxes. And you guys are going to see our basement. It's a disaster. It's disgusting down there. Don't judge us. My, this, that's where we shove, that's where we put all of the junk we don't use. So we're going to go down the basement and look for boxes. So let's go. Sorry it's so dark in my room, but it is. So let's go in the basement. This thing that's right here that keeps our basement door shut and turn this on and open the door because I have to. And obviously, we go downstairs that we have like that stuff, like all of that stuff is like laundry we haven't done yet, and like. That junk is stuff we don't use. So is that junk. It's just a lot of things we don't use down here. That's why it's obviously down here. So we're going to pull the switch. So I can obviously see. And you guys can see how messy our basement is like. But half the junk we don't even use. And it's down here. I have an inhaler down here. I didn't even know that. Like that bed full of junk right there. We don't even use that junk. It's just on that it's a cot. We just have it there because we don't have anywhere else to put it. So, yeah. So, I think that coffee box right there is empty. And I could put some things in there. Like, little things. I could use that. Yeah, this one's empty. I could put something in here. Even though it's a decaf breakfast thing that coffee for a cure came in but I could use it for something just because it has coffee and stuff on it doesn't mean anything it's empty I could use it so I'm gonna use this for like little things that I just have on the floor and that box right there might be empty there's boxes over there might be empty I don't know yet there might be boxes on that bed there might be boxes in our bedroom down here that's over that way on that side of the basement but yeah, let's see if this, that box is empty right there. And then we're going to see if the rest of the boxes, like, over there are empty. And then we're going to go in the room that's on the other side of this wall and see if there's any in there. So let's do it. My phone needs to stand away that you guys can see what I'm doing, but it's not going to because my phone can be stupid at times. And plus there's a pop sock on it. It doesn't help that that thing's on it. 
but that's on it for the point that I can stand my phone up, obviously. So you guys, I'm just gonna, I'm gonna try to balance you on a bottle of lotion that I have. It's not gonna work because my phone's retarded and doesn't like me. Hold on guys, I'm trying to get you guys a stand on the stuff, but it's kind of not working because my phone hates me a little. And my mom texts me because I asked her when we could FaceTime and she texts me, doesn't matter. So she's probably going to be texting me, what, what are you waiting for? And I'm going to just make up an excuse that I was talking to my friend on FaceTime. Even though I was making a YouTube video, but she doesn't know I have a YouTube channel. And if she finds out, she might tell my dad. And then my dad might make me delete it, so we're just not going to do that. So yeah, the only one who knows I have a YouTube channel in this family is my brother and my grandma. And one of my aunts. So let's take care of the boxes. Well, not take care of the receipts. So this one's empty. I can feel it's empty already. We had eggs in here. There were 60 eggs. But it's obviously empty, so I'm going to take this box and use it too. So I already have two boxes that could get used for stuff. I'm just going to put the boxes in a pile down here that I, and that I can use because, yeah. So now, I'm probably going to walk over there and look in those boxes. That's over here. Or I could just walk that way and check. But I might not because I don't know. So let's turn my camera so I can do that. If my phone likes me. Probably won't, but. So there's boxes over there that I'm going to check. Sorry for that laundry basket. It used to be in my room, but I took it out because I got a different one. So yeah, let's go check those. They're probably not empty. So that one isn't empty. So we're going to go around and check that one because I don't know if it's empty or not. I don't know if it's empty or full of junk. So yeah, I'm actually kind of scared to go over there for some reason, so I'm not going to. And the only reason I couldn't really get you guys to balance on the thing that you guys were balancing on because my phone was on this thing leaning against this thing. So that's why it was hard to balance you guys. I found two boxes ready, but I'm going to need like a few bigger boxes. Like probably the blankets. So this is the room I was talking about. Only reason you can't see in it because there's no light on. There will be in a minute. See so you guys, this is the room I was talking about. It used to be my cousin's old room. And I don't see any boxes down here that I could use. Besides like empty bags that I could use. But I want boxes, not bags. So this is just going to lean against my... Sit on my old work desk that used to be in my room. But I changed it to a white one. So there's no boxes in here. But... There's definitely some out there where I was in the first place. So that's the bedroom I was talking about. Fun, I know. So there might be boxes like over here that might be empty. I don't know. I could empty that box right there and use that box. And there's a box right there that I could probably use. Along with that bin thing that I could also probably use. If it has stuff in it, then I probably won't be able to, but... That's besides the point. So I'm going to shoot you guys right here and see if there's anything in that box right there. So I can use it if there is it. I'm going to hold you guys up by a sock. Don't worry about my techniques of holding you guys up. So I'm going to check that box. There's obviously stuff in it, but I can take it out. I'm just leaning against this thing. Yeah, there's obviously junk in that. This is an area of our washer and dryer and the mess of clothes we have. There's like a tub over there that we used that my grandma put like dolls in that I'm going to go get. Well, there's a lot of boxes over there that I'm going to go see about. But first, I'm going to try to see if my grandma will come down here first. And then if she says yes... Then I'm going to put shoes on so I can walk over there because, like, 
I shouldn't mean be down here without shoes because of the stuff and things that are on the ground. So I'm going to see if my grandma will come down here and then I'm going to put shoes on. Even if she doesn't, I'm going to, but I have to put shoes on. So yeah, but I found two boxes so far that are just going to stay there. So then, because I'll probably bring them up, bring them upstairs when my grandpa goes to bed. So I don't like, so he doesn't like ask me, what are you doing with those boxes? So I might do it when he's asleep and just put them somewhere in my room and clean my closet tomorrow when he's at work. So yeah, that was our disaster at Bed basement, but I'm coming back down here so you guys have to look at it again. <coughs> I've been thinking, even before this test business come up, I was thinking, if he could make machine guns for us, it could just down as easy there. make for anybody else. I'll take it. Oh, no. Down no, there. Yeah. Thank you. Oh, no. Okay, what are you doing down there? Oh, I'm trying to find boxes. I found two already. <laughs> and I think I've, and I found two already. They literally almost Baba, just got put down there. Just yeah. They just got put down there. Probably not even that long ago. I have a question. Yeah, I have a question. Do you want to come down there with help and help me find some? I found a tub that we could empty. Not empty. I ain't throwing that shit out. We could put it in a box that's right next to it. Grandma, do you want to come? Because I have to put my shoes on. Grandma, do you know that blue tub that's down there? Grandma. Grandma, I could empty that and put it in the box that's right next to it and take that thing. Do it. I ain't messing with it. We'll have to go put shoes on because I'm not walking over there. I'm not walking over there with no shoes. And why can't you come here and find boxes for me? Why can't you come help me find boxes? I don't put no boxes down there. Yes, you do. There's so many boxes down there. I've already found two. They're mine. They're full of shit. Yeah, well, I can empty them with other pillows than in other things. Well, calm down, let's not be very careful about running the same coverage over and over right here. They keep doing it, it's, it's going well for them, but they're playing with fire by having one safety back. I'm going to go get shoes and do it myself, because you're too lazy to go down there. Well, how about here? There it is, Tony. And incomplete. So that's my answer. Only reason she's saying no because she's too fucking lazy to get off that couch and fucking do something. That's her problem. Like, she's too lazy to go and up and get up and do something. Like, she would rather sit on the couch and watch TV and stuff. It's fucking annoying. Have my shoes on. Now let's go back down there and empty that tub out and see if that box right next to it is empty. I look around this room, I say to myself, there's a pretty good hitter here. Happy Levinsky is no fun. Why does my call me in? So we're back down here because I didn't shut the door or turn the lights off, so all I had to do was come back down. So I'm back down here in this messy basement of ours. And I'm going to turn on the bedroom light because, yeah. Cause I'm gonna be over there, but I don't know which way I should go. Cause I don't know if I should go that way or past the stairs. Cause <sighs> I'm just gonna go over that way because, yeah. I'm just scared to go over there for some reason. I don't know why. Even though I think that box over there is empty and I could use it because it's like big. Is there anything in here though that I could use? That I could use? But there's probably not because there probably just isn't. The thing is, there's never anything in the basement we need, except now. I found a box right here. Maybe I could empty and put the junk just on the bed and then use it. 
Maybe. It depends on what kind of junk is in it. Set you right there. Main lifting thing right there. What the heck kind of crap is in here? Oh, happy stuff. Wonder if there's a shirt in here that I can cut because there's a there's shirts that I really want to cut into like tank tops and stuff. Crop tops, not tank tops. But I can't because I never can find any. This is a shirt dad my aunt gave me. This is an old shirt that I could maybe crop. Not going to though, because it's probably too small on me. And I'm not gonna go through the rest of the shit because I'm not gonna do it. I'm just not going to. So yeah, that's that. Now let's point the camera back at the bed, even though you can't even see it. You can see me more than the bed. But is that okay? Like... Oh, this box has two sides on it. That's nice. I like that down there. Shouldn't that be upstairs? But it's kind of not. What the heck is in here? Shit. That might be what I put down here. I made this for my grandma. She never used it. She just threw it down here. That's sad. Never used any of this stuff. Wait, I could use this in my mask. Because my math is all about this crap. I could use some of this in my math. But I'm not going to because it's from last year. And that's just not going to happen. Here's like a thing that I did in 8th grade. It's old because it was in 8th grade. So it's obviously going to be old. I shouldn't just be throwing this stuff on the floor. I should actually be like putting it somewhere on the bed for this freaking basement of our floods but do you think I'm going to? No. Because I'm too lazy for that. So we have one empty box and it's divided so that would be that would be perfect. And I put all this shit on the bed. Shouldn't have did it but I did because why not? There wasn't even that much stuff in the box to begin with. So, I have three boxes. They're going good so far. You guys are just going to go right here because all I'm going to do is shove these boxes in this big box. Or at least try to. They don't fit that I'm sure to look. Okay, I have three boxes so far. One, a medium size, a small one, and a big one that has two sides on it. Now since I went over there, which it could have been spider webs over there, I'm just going to cross over there and see if that box is empty because there's a grocery bag in it with junk in it. So it has to be empty and I'm trying not to use any like grocery bags or anything. I'm trying to use like boxes. That's why I'm not taking any grocery bags because I'm trying to use boxes. It's just Amy. Can you guys see? Because the box is right there. You guys can't even see. Let me get some. Okay, that's, nothing's going to help this cause. Let's try and see if this thing will help. Probably won't, but we can try. Okay, can you guys see now because the box? That scared the fuck out of me because that box is right there. Okay, walked over here with no spider webs. And sorry if you guys see like the surface, it's a freaking table that was downstairs, upstairs, and then we took it, brought it down here. Okay, there's junk in that box, like picture, like photos, and books, those things. So that thing's full of junk. There's many boxes on this bed, like there's one right there, like there's a box right there. There's probably many boxes under this junk. I might empty that one out and take that one. But I don't feel like it. And I can even empty out that laundry basket and put things in that. But like, I want boxes in there, not laundry baskets. Okay. 
That's my slime box. That has my slime in it. So I have three boxes so far, which I think that's pretty good. For my grandma's saying there's no empty boxes down here. I want to check those buckets and stuff over there, but I'm too scared to go over there because there might be, like, spider webs and stuff. So I'm too scared. So I'm just going to wait until tomorrow to make my grandma come down here. Or she might come down here when my grandpa goes to bed. She's not doing it right now because my grandpa's awake. Sorry, guys. That was my phone. My phone decided it wanted to freaking fall almost. So, yeah. I have this box that has that have eggs in it that I can use. This pretty good size. Boom, you need to stop fucking falling. God damn. Then I have this thing that might work. Phone, I'm gonna fucking tell you this your shit. That might hold something. Now you guys are freaking. This might hold something. And then. I have this box that has two sides on it that will definitely hold something. So yeah, I'm going on a good start. I wish there were boxes in that room that were empty, but there's obviously not because I literally checked. And none of those boxes are empty. That box right there has my slime stuff in it. That thing has nothing. Why did I buy a, like, volleyball slash kickball thing when I have one right there from, like, five Christmases ago? Don't know. But I have three boxes over there. But I'm probably just going to wait until my grandpa goes to bed to bring them up there because... I'm not about to get yelled at for bringing boxes by boxes up there. I could empty this thing that has my slime in it and put it in something else. And take that box. Which I might because there's not even that much slime in there. Because I remember I only have like three containers of it. I might just empty that box and take that one out. Or this little container right here and take that. Because there's nothing much in that container. So I'm just going to empty that container and take it. So there's not even that much in this damn thing. Like there's just junk in it. That I just threw in here one day because why not? So we're both going to go through it together. Well, whoever watched my videos and myself. The lid's pretty dirty but that can get washed. So here's a purse that my grandma never used. She gave it to me, but I didn't use it. Here's some cloth she could use. Here's a case for your glasses she never uses. Here's another case for your glasses. Here's a little bag with a toothbrush in it. Okay. Your thing for your ID card, like a photo. I know, I guess, the name and stuff. My ID card thing. These things that were supposed to fit my phone but never did. The pink one broke but I still have both. This little purse that probably has something in it but I never checked it because I stopped using it. I'm going to laugh if there's money in it. Like, laugh. <clears throat> oh, there's no money in it. Dang it. Must have took the money out when I stopped using it. And even if there was money in it, it would be my money. So it's not like I'm stealing because I this was my purse at one time and it still is. I just don't use it. And then we have a little bow thing, whatever you freaking call it in here, that broke, I guess. And then we obviously have the container with the lid. And it has my name on it because I got this container from school. We used to put our library books in it. So each kid had one and they had to put their name on it. So it has my name on it so no one can say it's not mine. And if you don't know how to pronounce my name, it's Jera, J-E-R-R-A-H. It's 
my profile name, Jared Baker. That's my actual name. Except I didn't put the Renee in it. That's my middle name. So, yeah. I'm probably just going to put the junk that just came out of this thing back on the thing or in that box. I'll try to get it in that box. And then try to empty that box out. And then there's going to be a lot of junk on that thing. Which isn't good because I don't think my grandma wants that thing all cluttered up with junk. But guess what? I don't care what she doesn't want. Or I might just put everything in this purse. And this purse right here. Or I might just put all of it in these two purses. So then it doesn't look as bad. So yeah, let's see. I can hear my grandma coming. Okay, my grandma's coming. I think I can hear her walking. I don't know walking, but I don't know if she's coming down. Because she wasn't coming down when I first told her I wanted her to. I could find a leotard or something to put on this and then use it. So I'm not going to throw it away. I'm actually going to put it back in here and use it. Even though I probably don't need it, so I'm actually going to put it back. Because, like, my school don't require these ID cards. Like, my the district I go to doesn't need the ID card. They don't require them, like some schools. Because I know that... Florida schools require them because the only reason I know that because of YouTube is I watch that go there and because I have a cousin that goes to schools in the, that and I have a cousin that goes to that goes to school in Florida because his mom lives in Florida so that's where he goes to school from and his dad lives in North Carolina so he goes and with his grandma which is his mom so he goes to go see them during the summer when he has no school and then goes back home in Florida by his mom. So since I put everything in those two purses so it doesn't look as cluttered, I'm going to empty out that box and probably just shove everything back on the thing because I don't, I don't know where I'm going to put everything when I empty this out. So yeah, we're going to have a problem if I empty this out. I don't think my grandma would care because it's like junk that we don't even use or don't even need. That's obviously why it's down here. I'm honestly not even going to empty this out because I don't trust anything in here. So, I got this that I could definitely put something in. Because if it held library books, it will hold something besides books. So I have this and I have those three boxes over there. So I have four containers and they have containers like that blue one right there at Family Dollar and they're about $10 and I have a 20. So I'm going to ask my grandma if we can go there tomorrow so I can buy one with my 20 and then have a clean one and a brand new one instead of that old one that has junk in it. So yeah. What I found so far is this. I didn't find it. It was just over there. I knew it was over there the whole time. Then I found, then I have this that hold, held our eggs. This coffee thingy majigger that might hold something. Probably not going to. Then I have this box that has two sides on it that I can put junk, a lot of junk in. So yeah, I found that so far. And like I said, I'm going to ask my grandma if we can go to Family Dollar tomorrow. So I can buy one of those things over there that are over there. Tubs that are ten dollars. If you like the size that we have over there, it was ten dollars and I have a twenty, so I can buy one. And they hold a lot more than you think, so I can buy one. And I can ask her if she has a ten so she can buy one too for me if she wants to. She doesn't have to, I'm not gonna make her, but I'm gonna get one that's ten dollars and pay for it with my twenty. Even though I have over $20 without using my 20 so I might just use the $20 that I have without using my 20 and just use my 5s and 10s that I have. So, yeah. So, I found four things, and I'm going to ask my grandma if I can get one of those storage tubs that are over there for $10 at Family Dollar tomorrow, so then I can put more stuff in that. I'm going to bring these boxes up when I, my grandpa goes to bed. And this video is not supposed to be 
this long, but it is. And I'm going to say bye and probably do another one when I'm actually cleaning my closet when I bring them up. Sorry, because I don't want to yell that right now because my grandpa's going to be like, what are you doing with those? Well, he's not like that, but he's probably going to be like, what are you doing with those? I'm going to clean my closet and putting the, my stuff in here and I'm stacking them. So he won't yell at me. He'll just ask me what I'm doing. But anyways, bye. Peace.